Hey, it's Althea and Alia. Just wanted to show you in case you're going to be taking some trips uh, this summer, how you can use one piece of cloth to create four different looks. So Aliyah's going to start. Which one are you going to do first? I'm going to do a skirt. Okay. Um, and this is also called a sarong. Um, it has different names, but it's just a piece of fabric that you can take and tie different ways. So you want to start behind you. Um, and with the simple way is just to show a little leg on the side, take it with two hands, give it a little tie here. If you just want to loose, you know, something over your bathing suit, if you want something tighter, then you can tie it again. So that's on the side. And this is so sexy. Look at her split. Show Turn, the around, leg. Turn around, Aaliyah. Turn around, Aaliyah. Hey, 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 hey. Just the basic tie here loose comfortable and you see when she's walking you don't even see tight. her legs so this is kind of this is definitely a one size fits all deal mm -hmm. i want to show one more way if you don't want to tie you may say i don't have a lot of fabric can i still tie my skirt you can do the right piece over the left piece here and what you're going to do is tuck so you take that front piece and you fold it down fold the side down and you fold all the way around and it's tight. It does not matter how big your fabric is, you can kind of loosen it as you need to. And that's another way to tie your skirt. So right. you notice that Aaliyah said this is a sarong. These fabrics are very light, very breezy, but you'll notice that a lot of African fabric, which is a little bit thicker, is often twisted the last way that Aaliyah yeah. showed. Traditionally, when it's tied this way in African tradition, it's called a lapa which is just a piece of fabric that you tie and you can wear it as a skirt. I'm gonna show you how to create a shirt, a blouse. So the same way that Aaliyah started with the skirt bringing the fabric behind you, you bring it behind the back this time, crisscross in front and create a halter at the neck, tying in the back. One, Two, to make sure it doesn't fall because if it falls then it becomes a peekaboo top all right now you have all of this here and you could just do that you could just do that you could just do yes. that okay yes. work 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 or you can take the ends bring them together and tie it at the waist just like Aaliyah showed you with the front of the skirt you'll do the same thing wrap it one time you could let it hang or you can do it twice to make sure it doesn't come out and create a little bow top. Now you've got this little fanny piece that's covering the bottom. Yes, I love that, yes. But if you don't want the fanny piece because you want to show that bum bum, then you just roll it up like this, roll it up just like that. And now here you are. If you want to do a little peekaboo, just wrap your fabric in like this. And now you've got a little peekaboo in the middle. And one more thing for your top. If you don't want it to be a halter top across the neck, you can make it like a tube top and just tie it right at the chest. And for those of you with bigger boobs, it'll really stay up nicely. For me, I'm just gonna, you know, make it work for this, right? And here you go. That is super cool. Thank you, Elise. Okay, so you ready to go, Aaliyah, with the next one? Yes, so I'm gonna take my skirt and turn it into a dress. I'm gonna start off with the folding method. Just easy breezy, right? You keep it behind you. Um, you can actually start here. And to keep it tight, you kind of wanna tuck it just a little bit so you, you get the size that you want. Take it here, make sure it's tight enough, and then fold down. Okay, Aaliyah, walk away and walk back so they can see what's really happening. Uh, 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 uh. She's coming back with it. Uh, 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 uh. Hair swing, pose, freeze. <laughs> okay. All right, so one more way if you would like to have more of a tie. You can take this, and I'm going to switch it up. Not just tie, but kind of give it a little twist on turn, right? Twist on turn and go the opposite way. Ooh. So you have a little more tightness. Ooh. You have to pull it up, tie it around, lift up, tie it in the back, 
just like I did earlier. So you see her tying it in the back. So this gives it a, look, a slightly different look around the neck and it's adjustable. So don't be afraid to move the fabric. Yeah, or even move yourself yes. under the fabric to make it's things very fit and be move. where you want it to be. And you have your dress. Walk, 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 walk. Notice that now there's more legs showing. Walk, 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 pose. Okay? So what I love about this, I have one short shorts. So you can wear shorts, you can wear a bathing suit. Very comfortable, easy breezy, and you have a dress in less than one minute. And I'll tell you what else I like, Aaliyah. If somebody might be having a little extra here, for mm -hmm. whatever reason, it's a nice tell. camouflage, right? Tell. At all. Right. Okay, okay, we've given you three of four. I'm bringing up the rear with the last one. <laughs> this one is one of my favorites. You take the ends of a long piece of fabric or a sarong and you just make a small knot on the end. Not too tight because you want to be able to get it out, right? Just a small knot. Then do the same thing on the opposite end of the sarong. Into a mini okay. jacket. A cape jacket. If you get chilly, you have just created sleeves. If you just on a put your hand and through you want one. Breeze, this is it. Wow. My other, oh, here goes my other end. And you just put your hand through the other end. And I now, that. I love that. Yes. And turn and twist. about this is traditionally people will just take a sarong and just throw it over their shoulders right so this gives it style it does not matter what size you are what your build is this will accentuate your body it's nice and free-flowing you see how the wind accentuates her movements so great for photos and it's a great addition to the top so you literally have a whole outfit just from bringing sarongs and the great thing about sarongs they pack easily you can roll them up they're so small and so light let me show you, you with this so one much. so if you're packing for vacation or your trip buy a bunch of sarongs get creative you can that create your whole outfits. outfit heavy you have color because we talked about adding color to our wardrobe that's right not just simple white and black add a pop of color if you're going to the islands let the sun reflect off that beautiful skin and so you saw how big this piece of fabric was when I started. I folded three times, rolled tight, and now I take about five to 10 of these when I go on a trip and I have whole outfits from skirts to shirts, to jackets, to dresses, head elegant, wraps. casual, head wraps. We need to talk about Should we do wraps. one? Should I we do we one? Should. Yeah. yeah. Do one yeah. too because you like yours. I'm gonna do one with top. this. I do. I like my hair to be out at the top. And since yeah. my hair is in a ponytail, I can show you one like that. Okay, I'm going to fold mine long ways in half. Because the sarong is a lot of fabric. Just want to make wanna, it a little smaller. Yeah. So I'm gonna actually just take mine and fold it down maybe a quarter of the way down for the look I'm going for. And I am going to take it, start back. This is beautiful already. She pulled it from the front to the back. She gathered the ends and crisscrossed and exchanged them in her hands. As tight or as loose as you like. Crisscross again. And now you are just tucking the edges, right? So I'm serving. Turn sideways, Leah, so they can see how you're tucking. Yeah, see? And then she just tucked, 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 tucked all the way around. Very regal, very royal. Queen. Queen. Now, she came from the front with a little bit of extra fabric. I have a little bit less fabric, right? And I'm going to come from the back. Same thing, though, crisscrossing in the front with the extra fabric. Mm -hmm. Making sure that my hair is coming out the front and then when I come around the back, I'm going to crisscross again. Is my ponytail out? Yes. 
bring it to the front and then I'm gonna make one small tie in the front underneath the ponytail, just one. And then just like Aaliyah, I'm going to roll yes. and release my ponytail from the fabric on the top and bring it down. So yes. now I have this sarong look yes. with the ponytail going over to the side. Yes. Coordinated with my white. outfit. Okay. And then I'll just so touch this little end. Different sarong. So don't worry about matching perfectly. You know, coordinate with different colors. Get the hair off of your shoulders. If it's high outside, let that wind blow. Five different looks. We'll see you on the next trip. I'm Althea. And Alia. And make sure you let us know in the comments which one is your favorite look and which one you're trying next. Okay, make sure you follow us on social media. I'm Althea Lawton Thompson, everywhere you look. And I am Alia Kamala on all social media channels. That's it. Peace and light.